to another episode for the Mama Mixer. I am Sarah from Sensational Finds, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make apple strudel muffins. Mm-mm, good. I love to eat, and I love good food, so we are going to make these muffins, and I am pretty excited. So if you want to see how to make apple strudel muffins, then just keep watching. Okay guys, let's get baking. Here's everything that you're going to need. I will have the full recipe in the description box below as well. In a medium sized bowl, you're going to add two cups of flour. And then into those two cups of flour, you're going to add a one teaspoon of baking powder, one half of a teaspoon of baking soda, and a half a teaspoon of salt. Grab your spoon and mix up all of your dry ingredients. Now you're going to grab a large bowl and set the dry ingredients aside. Now it's time to crack those eggs. You're going to crack two eggs into the large bowl. Next you're going to add a half a cup of white sugar and a half a cup of dark brown sugar. Just go ahead and mix up all of those ingredients a little bit. Now you're going to want to add your softened or melted butter. I use softened butter. You could use melted butter. It would work either way and you're going to mix this up really, really well. You want to make sure that it's very, very smooth. This would probably be much easier if I had a hand mixer or a KitchenAid, but uh, your girl's going to be struggling mixing this up. So now 45 minutes later, you can see that I have a very smooth batter and we're going to add our vanilla. Add one and one fourth teaspoon of vanilla. You're just gonna wanna mix that all up. Now you're going to add your chopped up apples into the batter. You're going to wanna make sure that the apples are chopped really small because these are mini muffins, so you don't want the apple chunks to be too big. You can do more or less apples if you want as well, but I did two apples. Now slowly mix in your dry flour mixture and you're going to want to stir little by little just making sure that it gets all mixed up. The batter is going to look somewhat dry, but the apples are going to release moisture which is going to make the muffin nice and moist, so don't worry if the batter looks too dry. Once the flour mixture is all done, it should look something like this. Now it's time to fill up those cupcake tins. I did fill them all the way up because they were mini cupcakes, but you don't have to. We are going to add the crumble on top. To make the crumble topping, you need one third of a cup packed brown sugar, one tablespoon all-purpose flour, one eighth of a teaspoon ground cinnamon, a pinch of nutmeg, and one tablespoon of cold butter. Using a fork, you're going to cut the butter into the flour and cinnamon mixture. It's going to make this crumble, which is really good, and I think it's the best part of the muffin. So you're just going to cut it into the butter, and you'll see that eventually, once you do it for a little bit, you will see it turn into these little crumbles, and I think that's the best part. Now it's time to take the crumble and add it to the muffins. I am going to do this probably the worst job in the world. I ended up using a spoon because I made a ginormous mess, but you know, I am no chef. So add it to the top and do your best. You're going to bake your muffins at 375 for about 20 minutes. Once they're done, you're going to let them cool and voila, you have apple strudel muffins and they are so delicious. These are perfect warm, but they're also really good frozen. These are the perfect muffin to freeze so that you can keep them for a while. We are going to see what my taste testers think. Okay, Mr. Quincy, what do you think? Yep, he takes his first bite, and I think mom should have cut it up a little bit more. <laughs> and can I get a smile? Oh yeah, Quincy, give me that smile. Now Bobby's turn, my picky four-year-old, what does he think? Thumbs up. Okay, it's a winner. Now it's my husband's turn. He's first test taste. Thumbs up or thumbs down. Mm. These muffins are taste tester approved. 
So I hope that you guys give this recipe a try. Leave a comment down below letting me know what your favorite type of muffin is. We are having another hangout on Tuesday and it is all about siblings. We are going to be on Loretta Fun for Lala's channel. I will have that link in the description box below. Be sure to go check it out um, and subscribe to her so that you don't miss the hangout. If you aren't subscribed to the Mama Mixer, make sure you hit that subscribe button because it will make us happy. And we will see you guys on Tuesday. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.